Meow. Hello there, Steve Rossé coming at you from Sydney, Australia, Creative Coaching Productions. I'm the principal tuba player of the Sydney Symphony Orchestra. Unfortunately, most of you viewing this are in isolation or some sort of a quarantine. Universities have been shut down and it is with my heart-filled commitment to do everything I can to contribute to the furthering growth and development of the international tuba community, especially students around the world who have no access to live one-on-one -on -one lessons with their teachers uh, for a few weeks or so um, and are not allowed to go to the universities. So this is my commitment and my gift, so to speak, to the international tuba community on YouTube. Two studio classes a week until this thing passes and you're all able to get back into school and get back with your, your classmates, all right? So, let's move on now. Studio class number one, Steve Rossay's online course. We are going to start with some breathing, posture, and meditation exercises for about five to 10 minutes. And then when this section one finishes, you can take a break, do that as long as you want. Go to section two, and then section three. Total time will be 30 to 45 minutes of video time. All right, and thanks for joining. All right, so here we go. We're going to start our session like we should start every day by detaching from what's happening in the rest of the world. Now this doesn't even pertain to what's happening today in the world, but last year, next year, and 10 years from now, wherever you are, whenever you are, when you get to your practice space, make sure that you have a ritual of unplugging from the outside world, turn off all electronics, um, except for the ones that you need for this session, all right? So we're gonna begin by sitting tall, shoulders back, chest up, long, soft neck, and we're gonna take three big, deep breaths to connect our minds with this tuba journey we're about to go on together. Here we go, three deep breaths. Great. Now what we are doing, we are combining our use of our air with our posture and our mental state. We really want to focus on what we're going to be doing with the tuba here. We want to focus on the sound we want to make on the tuba. We want to focus on how our body's going to feel taking in that air. We want to focus on what the air feels like and what the air sounds like. Quick little lesson here, quick little tip. The sound of the air coming in will determine the sound of the air coming out. i give you an example. You got it, all right? So we want to listen to the sound of the air coming in and make a tuba sound with that air coming in. And that will open up our body. As I said, chest up, long, soft neck. Let's do this again. Three big, deep breaths. Because once you got this, you're unstoppable in your progress, in your journey. All right, here we go. Three big, deep breaths. Great. And the beautiful thing about the internet these days is we can be doing this all together with this recording, um, hundreds of us, thousands of us, all right? Now, we're going to go to the next step, and that is a bit of meditation through breathing. We're gonna take 10 deep breaths, and with, with each breath, I want you to think of energy and healthy oxygen filling your lungs and your body, oxidizing your bloodstream, giving energy to your brain, your heart, and your soul, everything, all right? And with each exhalation, you will be able to feel a relaxation of all the muscles in your body, especially the upper body around your chest and your upper arms and shoulders and neck. We don't want any tension um, at all when we play the tuba, except the minimum um, amount to play the instrument. So we want to get rid of tension. We want to get rid of 
negative and distracting thoughts out with each breath. Focus on that. 10 big deep breaths in, healthy, out, release. You can say words to yourself like inhale, healthy oxygen, energy, and when you go out, you can say release, relax, detox, mentally and physically. Whatever words you can come up with, focus on those words, focus on the sound of the breath and the feeling of the body with this full, healthy air. All right, here we go, 10 of these. Wonderful. Check in with how you feel now. How do you feel? If you've got my practice journal and you've printed it up, write it in. About my practice journal, if you want a copy, just send me a Facebook um, private message asking for that PDF and I'll send it to you. It's wonderful. You track what you do and you write down how you're feeling. You write down goals. Anyway. That's to discuss later. Let's continue with this lesson. Now we've done some initial setting up breathing and meditation. Now we're ready to start blowing air through the tuba, but we're not gonna play yet. Now a big tip I always tell my students is that you shouldn't play the tuba, you shouldn't play your first note of the day until you're mentally prepared and your body is prepared and you are moving your air in, 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 a, in the proper, best possible way. Then you're not getting um, the best use of your time, all right? So now we've got our instrument. And by the way, this isn't just for tube, it's also for all brass. So if you have uh, brass player friends who wanna join in on this, by all means, invite them. It's, this is for everybody, all right? Now, I want to practice my air movement through the tuba so I can feel the resistance the tuba is gonna make and so I can uh, feel the association of, of the tuba in my hand. So we wanna hold the tuba so we're, or whatever brass instrument you're playing fully upright and we're going to take our biggest deepest breath remember what it sounded like the air that you were moving during meditation is basically what you want to do through the instrument now not different so here we go we're going to do 10 just through the instrument open valves whatever instrument happens to be if you're playing a small instrument like a trumpet or horn and you have uh, some back resistance it's okay to have air at the end and just exhale it before the next breath here we go Each one deeper and longer. Ten from the biggest. Here we go. There we go. All right. If you're feeling a little bit dizzy while you're doing that, it's fine. Take it easy, make sure you're sitting. If you get too dizzy, take a break. Just take a big exhalation and, and hold that out for a while and then you will recover. Um, getting a lot of oxygen to the brain at once is called hyperventilation 
and it takes the body a while to get used to. So if you're not used to it, take your time. This is not a macho competition or anything like that. We're just developing this tuba players. All right, now the next step is to do the same thing, but we'll do five breaths. And if you have valves on your instrument, put them all down to get different resistance. If you've got a trombone, um, put both valves down or whatever valves you might have and then slide all the way out. All right, you can do five big breaths. You'll feel the resistance of the instrument and what we want to do is we want to use the weight of the air in the lungs, in all of the lungs, to naturally fall out by the collapsation of the lungs by the atmospheric pressure around that and that's all the pressure you will need, no more. The air is going to do the work so that when we get to playing the tuba the air is doing all the work and the lips are just singing in the wind. Alright, here we go. Just air work for now. All valves down. Fire. Wonderful. So, in part one of this session, we have covered um, starting the initial practice session of the day, we have done meditation, and we have done breathing, and they're all connected, and we have done some air exercises through the tuba as well. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to have this video stop now, so you can stop this, and you can continue on as a class or as a group with your own breathing exercises, or you may want to just continue to the next section, which will be a little bit of calisthenic exercises mixed with air, mouthpiece buzzing, and some initial playing. Like I said, total time of this will take you um, 45 minutes to an hour and a half. Total video time, 30 to 45 minutes between these three parts, these three sections. All right, so I'm gonna turn off the video now and I'll see you at the next section, all right?